friends uh, today i wanted to talk about uh, something interesting on the uh, behavioral finance yes and how different styles were adopted by the fund manager uh, which could be growth oriented which could be value oriented or which could be a combination of growth uh, growth and uh, value fine uh, i have some of my investors uh, who always find that uh, to find the next best fund uh, or the next most happening thing but predicting is not our job our job is to help the client to reach their financial goal by staying invested according to their risk profile and asset allocation fine okay let me give you some examples to illustrate my point for example there are some flexi cap funds say like parag parik flexi cap fund or a uti uh, flexi cap fund which has have a very good track record but in the last 2 years they have underperformed vis-a-vis uh, -vis other uh, flexi cap if you go through the portfolio you will understand those funds has a growth oriented portfolio where it is more of a growth stocks where the price to earnings of those stocks as much higher and which will continue to do well in the long run but in the last one year post the russia ukraine crisis what has happened in the stock market is that most of the value stocks which is actually undervalued and which has been beaten from 2019 to 2022 has rallied in the last one year so value as a theme has got the unlocking and it has delivered so it does not mean that growth will not undeliver because this cycles will keep repeating as based on the market opportunities which is available uh, across the world not only in india across the globe so as an investor when you are investing in uh, equity asset class it's very important that you have the uh, uh, understanding of the fund manager style and also give enough time frame for example if an sip it has to be 10 years if it is a lump sum it has to be 5 years plus then only years out of the market cycle you will deliver because even if it is a growth or value when you stay invested for 10 year you will understand that uh, uh, most of the growth or value or a combination of both will give you the same very similar cagr returns so here i would like to highlight that science keeps evolving but finance keeps revol revolving what has come up has come down what has come down will come up so it is important that whenever you understand you also need to look at the different styles and whether it will shoot your risk profile as well as the time frame then we need to invest according to that i hope you would have got some clarity on the different style adopted by the fund manager we will discuss more on that in the coming days thank you